Yeah, what I was saying was, I, I went to the Lancaster campus, the university campus, and also to um, the, the main street in Kendall. And uh, I think they can be used for video, for connecting bits of video together. And we could maybe do the same sort of thing in Exeter. Um, if you have one spot is a techie spot, so there's certain buildings that, that s seem to have more technology associated with them than other ones, and other spaces can be seen as public space. I think I think you can do sequences, fit, fitting things together. Right. Um, and the arts centre, the brewery arts centre in Kendall, is going to go all techie. So I might might find more resources there hmm. that would fit fit in with things. But I I don't know. In Exeter, it seems to be moving along. We're going to have. Um, like mines in October, yeah, yeah, and that seems just seems to be becoming normal now. Like the social media and the technology. I mean, this must be the fourth or fifth time they've been here. Mm, mm, yes. You would think it's all becoming standard. Yeah, well, do they have like mines anywhere else in the country. I think so. I think they have them in London, right, and various other places. But they do seem to keep coming back here. Yeah, they must. They must. Uh, they must think it's a good success. They must think it's successful to have it down here. Yeah, well, I think there's enough local people, and also the people who come from London and Bristol and other places. Yeah. Find Exeter okay. Yeah. Well, Exeter is a very, very small place. Relatively. Yeah. But I think if it, if it, if it's um. If it has conferences like that, events like that, it then the ideas... It, it gets people down here. Well, but what really annoys me with that show is you pay 150 quid for a ticket and lunch should be included for 150 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> well... Don't, don't you agree? Well, I don't know. But compared to, no, compared to a lot of conferences, John, that's, that's the going sort of rate. Right. Um... And they sort of send... I don't know what they're going to do, because it's going to be at the castle this time. So whether they're going to send us off around other places to eat at lunchtime, I don't know. Right. But the other thing I'd mention is that I, th I think Phonic's getting more into social media as it goes on. So we might make a few more connections with it. And the the whole sort of set of ideas might become a bit more normal. And then maybe there's going to be places around Exeter we could use as backgrounds for discussion. Because mm. just, just going back a bit, what, what I'm trying to do in when I go to Kendall or to Lancaster University campus is just sort of have a discussion about a digital transition or more of a social media situation using, using the backdrop. Right. So a, a campus or a city centre... They're both suitable spots, I think, to link things together. Right. So we'll see. We'll see how it might work, and see if we can get some interviews around like minds as well. Okay. Um. So anybody, if anybody's got got some ideas about that, do do tweet to us. W e n o t n o, and we'll we'll see how that how that works out. 